Well, the Black River Preserve has done a lot of great things around the Black River area, and I wanted to get an opportunity to see what does that look like. It's real world, and it brings you back to the reality of being able to get along with each other and enjoy just Mother Nature. And I think when we get back to those things, that's getting back to our heritage and our history and our roots. And when we get back there, then we can see a big change in how things are just done as old and how we get along and communicate with each other. And in my area of work, hey, that's so important. Relationships that are positive. And I think here you can use the resource that you have to foster positive relationships. Just to have an opportunity to see the Black River Cypress Reserve behind the scenes. Uh, it, it, was, it was a great experience. Um, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the colleagues that were able to come out as well. Exposure for young people is, is something that I take pride in. Um, just being here today just, just opened up another avenue just to be able to go back and be able to bring more young people to come out and take advantage of this. I mean, you're talking 10, 20 years down the road, they will be able to see firsthand what they can do job opportunities, um, just family outings, they'll be able to see it firsthand and take advantage of it. It provides a lot of uh, partnerships. Uh, we can collaborate from both counties, Georgetown County and Winsburg County, and just have an opportunity to be able to bring other visitors that are traveling through that actually wants to see the Black River. We have other resources that we can connect them with. It never occurred to me that the river we were growing up on and the river that we knew about and that we had a relationship, whether it was through fishing or swimming or bird watching or whatever, was world class, right? World class. And I look at rivers for a living and I take people and do environmental, environmental education on the Santee and the Watery and the Congaree and the Cooper and the Ashley and the Wando. And I've been here, this isn't my first go round on the Black River, but it is a stunning river. It is, it is, there's something to it that it's, it's, it's greater than I could imagine as a boy um, because I've seen a lot of rivers now in this country and other countries. But this is a, this is a, a natural wonder of a river. I, I would call it easily world class. I don't, I bought plane, I bought plane tickets to go see rivers that aren't as good as this river in Williamsburg County. And it's protected and all the energy around it that protects yeah, it. And I, I was thinking about the, the, the health of the river and the sort of philosophy and the poetry of the river and how a river, here's one for you, let's see what you think about this. A river is at its origin and its destination simultaneously, right? So it's, it's about the journey of the river and the life of a river. And a river and the life of a river flows through a community. And a community also has a life and a health. And I think the more closely you can be in contact with the river, the healthier your community can be. It's really and truly a blessing to be able to have such a majestic location here. Um, it gives you a sense of pride, it gives you a sense of peace, and it just um, gives you much, much more to uh, work towards. We also deal with our students and we look forward to them having the opportunity to come out here to the Cypress Point and enjoy some of the beauty, take in some of the majestic uh, birds and, and the wildlife that they have here on scene. Um, just being able to go out kayaking and be able to enjoy the cypress trees and, and the lovely scenery and get an appreciation for some of the things that we have uh, this close to us here in Williamsburg County. I think it's a great opportunity for our citizens to come out and enjoy the amenities from hunting, fishing, kayaking, which I did today for the first time in my life, and I really enjoyed it. For the most part, it's just getting out and enjoying nature. The most important thing is when you come outside, you get an opportunity to have your imagination run wild. 
I mean, you're in the forest, you know? And so when you got kids that's out here, they're able to just imagine themselves as um, pirates. They can imagine themselves as swimmers, divers, just all sorts of things. And it's just getting them away from the electronics and being able to socialize with their family. I think it's important for especially a county that is 65% African American to know that they can have access to the river, to learn about uh, the different things that the river provides, to also, you know, seek peace and solace and to understand how the trees came into being and how much like the trees and much like nature, if we operate like that, we can have a harmonious world. So this is very important and I think the um, broadening the, the awareness of the Black River Cypress is extremely significant and we're definitely going to do our part to do that.